Hello dear friends. I forgot which one we had last time. Oh, this one is a little bit knocked. Anastasia. Anastasia. <clears throat> we have tried Paris. This one is Imperial Label. I think we have tried last time. And uh, Mont Nana. It's a uh, spare mint. We have tried. This one, English breakfast and Kashmir chai. Kashmir chai, sure we have had. So today we will use this one. This one is English breakfast for the evening. This, the irony is the English breakfast is, but it's actually pretty correct. English breakfast in US, this must be evening time. So I'm doing the right thing. Let me check what is the time for London. London time. Time. London. Time. Uh-oh. 2 o'clock. 2 a.m. Green, Greenwich Mean Time. Green. Green. Mean time. Current word time. Oh yeah, it's a 2 a.m. So this must be an early breakfast tea. We first open it up and see what spoon fits this well. Okay. Last time we choose a spoon. It's a pretty spoon, but not uh, the best fitting. Uh oh, yeah, this one is not so easy to open. Mm -hmm. A little bit too tight. Something wrong with the mechanic. Maybe next time I change. Gosh. I am afraid it will all fall out. Oh, oh. Seems good. Feels good. Do not look at it. Mm -hmm. Gosh. Okay. Feels good. Feels good. Almost there. No rush. Almost there. Afraid it will all fall out. Gosh, what is wrong with this? Last time I said when it is so clumsy, it's becoming even entertaining. And this is absolutely the gap, the case. Okay. One, two, three. Gosh. Mm. Yeah, this is the case. <laughs> anyway. So, I will use this little spoon. Put it one. It smells of cinnamon. And I think this is the spice for meat soup. I really cannot understand the English guys and the ladies. They eat meat soup tea for the morning. Hmm. 
Okay. This is absolutely entertaining, I, I think. This is a new kitchen tower, so I will not... What is wrong with this one? Where is the problem? It is too tight. Let me change another. All of this. Gosh, this one also. Oh, this one is loose. It's okay. Then this one cannot close up. Huh? Yeah, this one is perfect. Good. Good. Now it's good. You see this one? This one is a little bit too tight also. So at least we can take the um, take advantage of this uh, this one is good. We can take it. No, we, we didn't try it. We, we are not. What did we have? We had cashmere chai. Yeah, this is cashmere chai. So I'm sorry, any English guys. You didn't drink meat soup. It's the cashmere chai. Kashmir chai is the Kashmir uh, drink tea with uh, with so much spice. So I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to make any confusion, but I just anyway made the confusion. Okay. So this one we can collect it and uh, use for another time to drink tea. Maybe I can use this for cooking, cooking egg, um, egg, um, the egg, um, the five spice egg. Oh, yeah, that's too far. Where is the zoom? Anyway, let me put it back into a place. Do not have a container handy for now, so I will put on a piece of paper. Okay. We will do it later anyway. So here's the tea. I think you should be almost good. If it is chai, it needs even hotter water, so I'm doing a little bit not as hot. So we can do a little bit longer time, and at the same time we read the description of this tea. The table looks very sad without this, uh, with this paper towel, right? So let's get some something to make it pleasant. Okay. We need some color. Life is full of color. If, uh, if there is no color, it's not even fun. Okay, So, cashmere chai. Yeah, this is the right zoom. Cashmere chai, mélange de thé et d'épices selon la recette traditionnelle népalaise, 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 cashmere. Ok. Blend of tea and spices according to the traditional Nepalese rice recipe. Ok. It's from Nepal. Oh, I remember when I was in Nepal, Nepal in Kathmandu, we drank tea, which was very, very strong. Yes. Okay. See you later, alligator.